welcome. Today we're going to be looking at two awesome duffels from Lug. Now both bags have a removable and completely adjustable crossbody strap, the steamboat comes with grab handles, and the cartwheel too will come with shoulder straps. Those other handles are not removable on either bag. You will have a padded slider with the steamboat that can be taken off or put back on. The cartwheel too will not come with a padded slider, but the strap is the right size for one. If you have a bag that has a slider, you can put that on the strap if you want to. Both bags have a completely wipeable bottom with four plastic feet, and both bags come with stretchy cargo pockets on the side, so this is where you would put your water bottles, and they're large enough to hold your large coffee tumblers as well. And this is where you would attach your crossbody strap on both bags. So starting with the Cartwheel 2, you have a small zip pocket on the front of the bag. Inside, there is a stretchy bungee cord with a clip, this cord is not removable, and this is where Lug intended for you to be able to put your keys so you could access them easily. The other pocket on the front of the cartwheel is a large, soft lined pocket, so this would be a safe place for your cell phone. If you saw my walkthrough video on this bag last week, you know that you can actually fit up to an entire Nintendo Switch in this bag, and it does take up that whole front pocket where those seams are. Now with the Steamboat, this front pocket here can hold any size lug wallet that you've got. Now anytime Lug does a compartment like this, I like to refer to it as a built-in office. It has everything you need right in one spot. You've got a place for your keys, just like the Cartwheel 2. You have five card slots, and above that, a clear ID window next to two pen slots. Then you have two stretchy cargo pockets, neither of which are soft-lined, beneath one clear view window that shares a zipper and is divided down the middle, creating two separate compartments. So with the Steamboat, you're going to get your traditional magnetic closure cell phone pocket that is fleece-lined. Both handles will come with anti-slip grip. With the grab handles on the Steamboat, you're going to get them 360 all the way around. And on the Cartwheel 2's shoulder strap, you'll get the anti-slip grip on the underside of the strap only. Both bags feature a large and padded laptop sleeve. You're going to get at least an extra inch in the Steamboat, but anything under 15 inches will fit nicely in both bags. Both bags have a trolley strap with a Velcro closure, but the Cartwheel 2 will be able to fit over a larger suitcase handle than the Steamboat will. On the back of the Cartwheel 2, you have a shallow pocket on the bottom of the bag, and on the back of the Steamboat, besides the pocket that the backpack straps are stored in, there won't be any other pockets. The backpack straps are padded, and the underside of the straps feature the same anti-slip grip that you can find on the grab handles. And while the Cartwheel 2 does not have backpack capabilities, it does have a built-in Clearview organizer. Now remember, the Steamboat came with the Clearview pocket as well, so let's see the two side by side so you can get a better idea of how they compare. And just like with the Steamboat, on the Cartwheel 2, one of the Clearview panels will be divided down the center, but it will still share a zipper. With the Cartwheel 2, there will be a board on the bottom of the bag, and when you're using it, you push that board down and it gives the bag structure. On the Steamboat, you will not have a board you have to push down. There is still a board, but it is underneath the lining and built in. Both bags will feature a privacy zip pocket on the back wall of the main interior, and on the opposite wall, you will have two stretchy cargo pockets in both bags. None of them are soft lined, so in that regard, the bags are the same. So if you're only going to get one of these bags, you just have to consider what features you're really going to appreciate. Do you want backpack straps? Do you want the grab handles and a crossbody strap? Then you want the steamboat. If you want the shoulder straps and you want the crossbody and you don't need a backpack, you might want to consider the cartwheel. So that's going to wrap this video up. I hope you guys enjoyed it and it gave you a better look at the steamboat and the cartwheel too. If you're new here and you want to see more content like this, consider subscribing. And if you've been a subscriber for a while already, thank you for the support. Don't forget to share the videos, that way we can keep converting people. Thanks so much for watching everybody, and I will see you guys next time.